Hello everyone, my name is Jason, the co-founder of pdf 2 onekey Today I'm going to give you a quick demo of what pdf 2 onekey does and why it's super, super beneficial in saving huge amounts of time in your revision workflow. In essence, pdf 2 onekey generates resources such as flashcards, notes, and quizzes from your PDF file, and you can get a personalized learning tutor to teach you that's trained on your material. So here's a dashboard of pdf 2 onekey and where you can actually manage, edit, and you delete your decks. So let's click into a deck that I've uploaded. So each deck is associated to the PDF file. So this could be a textbook, your lecture notes, PowerPoint presentations, or your lecture slides, etc. And there are various modes in PDF to Wanky. So there's flashcards mode, tutor, notes, MCQs, and close. And I'll quickly go through each of them. So flashcards is our standard signature mode where you can generate flashcards directly on the fly from your material. But you can select the model here. So we recommend the standard model where it's optimized for language formatting and we try to remove some of the redundant flashcards such as who taught this lecture. Uh, the legacy model is kept here because some of the users loved it. So we, we kept it in here since day one. You select the question style here as well as the question difficulty and then you can just press generate and then that's it. You can see the flashcards generate right in front of your face and stream directly in front of you. And it takes actually, uh, we optimize the speed for generation. So it actually takes very, very short amount of time to generate a lot of cards. And boom, there it is. Uh, you can see the flashcards. And on the left-hand side, you have the PDF. And on the right-hand side, you have the flashcards. And you can notice that you can actually switch between different pages of the PDF and vice versa on here. So basically on the right hand side, all these flashcards here are actually generated from this page because both of these are page free. So if you want to refine the flashcards, there are various ways you can refine your cards. So number one is you could actually uh, regenerate this page uh, entirely and give it a second attempt either using standard or high quality mode. You could also edit the cards as well as delete the card. So these are all the human modifications you could do. But most importantly, we can actually have a bottom regeneration bar as well. So let's say I'm not very happy with this page of cards. I could, for example, can you just make three cards only? And then so it will basically regenerate this page based on what you put in in your requests. And yeah, I will try to most importantly to follow your instructions. And there you go. So you could have there are three flashcards here instead of uh, a couple more previously. And after you're happy with your cards, you can now download them straight into various formats and flashcard programs. And you can also review your flashcards directly in our platform if you're happy with it. So there are also other versions of flashcards you could generate and select from. So most notably, you have the MCQs mode where you can actually generate multiple choice questions based on your material. There's also the close mode. So close means fill in the blank. So you can see the questions here are most mainly fill in the blank style questions where a blank word or phrase is taken out of and you can try to fill in the blank. So these are different flashcard formats you can generate in PDF Twanky. Besides from flashcards, we also offer notes. So in notes, you could actually generate notes, a table style, Cornell style, as, we, as well as summary style. So let's say I want to select note style and I simply press generate. And then the AI will try to read through your entire PDF and then generate some summary notes based on that. So as you can see, here is some very beautiful markdown notes that we have generated. And then we could then copy and paste this into our notes app or some markdown reading apps. So fascinatingly, in version three, we've also launched a new brand new tutor mode. So tutor mode is basically a personalized tutor that is trained on your material and then can answer questions, guide you and even test you from your material. So we recommend actually revising the material first and then going through the tutor mode. So for example, here um, I've asked like, uh, uh, this is a conversation that I've gone through with my tutor and I've asked it some questions and then it will try to actually prompt me to whether explore some further concepts in material or even ask me questions and test me based on the material. So let's say I want, um, I am happy uh, with all the concepts now after the conversation. So at the end of the lesson, the tutor would actually try to give me some personalized feedback from this mini lesson. So the lesson will take around five to 10 minutes and then it will give me a summary of the key points of the conversation I've gone through with the tutor as well as the good points of my understanding and the areas that 
the conversation thinks that, oh, what areas I'm struggling and the recommendations for the areas of study. You could also see that there is a customized study plan that Tutor has planned for me, which is basically based on the topics from your material and then which topics that we've covered in this conversation and which topics are not covered in your conversation and a great uh, familiarity score from these different topics so that I can easily identify which areas are weak in my understanding and go on to revise via flashcards, notes, or the MCQs that I've generated in the platform. So this is a quick tour of PDF to Anki. So there's a lot more behind the scenes, behind the platform, and we're constantly improving and listening to your user feedback. So if you've got any questions, feel free to reach out to us via the chat or our email hotline. Without further ado, I'll leave you to it and happy studying.